Hi, I'm Don Cargill, and we're going to try troubleshooting a TXV valve. Uh, usually, the first indicator is uh, when you look up outside to the high and low side that your uh, low side is extremely low, and your high side is like three, four hundred. Usually, what happens with that is uh, with the high side being so high, it'll kick out on thermal uh, overload, or the pressure switches will kick it out. Um, uh, once you establish that uh, that the high side is that high, we want to go inside and look at the TXB valve and uh, troubleshoot it. Off the air handler, and this is the TXB valve. Usually, a good sign when they're running, uh, when the system is actually running, it uh, actually throws up or frosted over all the way back. Uh, uh, when that happens, the TXB is bad. Uh, the TXB is a metering device. Uh, the, the difference between this and, and like the piston style is you actually have a piston and this is another type of metering device like a piston. Uh, unlike a piston though, when this goes bad you have to replace the entire thing. Um, this one is just requires to evacuate the system. Um, uh, it unscrews on the top, it's got a flare there and disconnects there. And when you put it back, uh, it goes back basically the same way you take it out with a sensor connected to the pipe. Uh, other than that, uh, my name is Don. Have a good day.